An after-prom party turned violent over the weekend in Peoria County, and the sheriff says it was gang violence. It's Monday evening. I'm Tyler Lopez. And I'm Janice Ruppold. Thanks for joining us at 6. It leaves one teen shot in the head. He's fighting for his life tonight. Well, is late joining us now to explain how this gathering formed and roll chill coffee in tonight's top story, Liz. Tyler, Janice, the Peoria County Sheriff says the venue by Singing Woods Nature Preserve was rented out by an adult and they were told it was for a birthday party. But Saturday night, there were more than 100 kids there from local high schools. An after prom party turned violent. Peoria County Sheriff Chris Watkins says 48 rounds of gunfire were fired at Valley Lake Center in rural Chillicothe around 1 a.m. Sunday morning. Deputies say a fight had broken out in the parking lot. That violence left an 18-year-old boy shot in the head. And deputies report the victim had a weapon in his waistband, later traced as stolen from Texas. There's one kid in the hospital that's fighting for his life right now. Um, but 48 rounds, it's, I'm shocked there wasn't more. Regional Superintendent Beth Kreider says school after prom parties have dwindled since the pandemic. Now she wants parents to keep an eye on their kids' whereabouts, especially with graduation parties just around the corner. We want them to take risks. We want them to do things that are new and exciting, and we want them to take on responsibility. But what we don't want is for that new risk to be fatal. She also encourages the community to step up and provide more things for kids to do after school to keep them out of trouble. Schools cannot do this alone. It's a heavy burden with a lot of resources and it takes a lot of manpower. Who else can jump in and offer some of these alternatives for kids? Because the kids are telling us that they need them. Watkins says this shooting was, quote, 100% gang related and is asking for witnesses to come forward and give information. I encourage if a parent knows their kid was there, give us what, I mean, you can still remain anonymous, but please give us something uh, to keep working on this because um, I'm, af I'm afraid there's going to be more uh, that spawns from this. The sheriff's office has not identified a suspect as of yet. For 25 News, Liz.